joined by Mark O'Meara, who's racing a young trotter in the third race, the standard bred for two-year-old Colden Gelding Trotters. Mark is no stranger to the winner's circle. He campaigned the champion pacer, Jate Lobel, and you won a Breeders' Crown last year with Lassie's Gold, too. Yeah, we did real good at the end of the season with her. Uh, that's uh, dad, my dad trains her, and I was able to race her in the Breeders' Crown for him. Now, we haven't seen much of Lassie's Gold this year. I know she raced at the Meadowlands this spring in a classic Oaks, but what's the story with her now? Uh, she had a few races uh, this year. In uh, Most of them were in distance races. Uh, we were trying to point her for that series and, and race her around this country a little bit, maybe ship her overseas next year, but uh, she gotten sick. Uh, she colicked on us and she had to have surgery and uh, just when she was starting to come around pretty good, you know, it took a little while for her to get sharp last year and we were looking forward to the middle and the end of the season and just at that point she got sick and, and got sidelined for the season. Now this trotting colt that you're uh, racing today, unscheduled, has not had a lot of success. You had to hit the board in seven tries. Looks like you uh, did some work with him though on the big mile tracks in the Midwest and how do you think he'll do here today? Well, he, he's a colt that just keeps growing. He's grown an awful lot from the beginning of the season until now, and, and we wanted to race him uh, a little more into the season to, to let him come along at his own pace. And uh, uh, this probably is not the best track suited for him, uh, the smaller track. We just try to keep him on the bigger tracks to let him uh, learn, learn uh, to trot and get comfortable with himself. But, but it's a short field and he drew inside, so uh, we're, we'd like to keep him uh, right side up and, and try and get a prize in there. Well, one thing about it, with five horses, you will get a check in this one, so it was worth the ship. Mark, your whole family involved in racing. Your dad, Frank O'Meara, had a very interesting experience. He went over to Italy to train for a couple of years. Yeah, he was over there. He's been back now uh, a couple years, uh, but he was over there for about four years. Uh, it was quite an experience in uh, seeing the European style of race, and uh, he probably uh, he probably advanced uh, their style of racing considerably while he was over there. <laughs> they liked him a lot when he was there. You know, he was he was pretty well known and respected there. Well, with his personality, I'm sure your dad is well liked wherever he goes. Frank O'Meara, one of the uh, true icons of trotting horses, and your brother Danny O'Meara is back racing too. Right, he came. He went over to Italy too for a while and helped out Dad over there, and uh, and also when. He stayed there and took over some of the duties when Dad came over here. Eventually, he came back over here and was assistant with Dad. Well, I'll tell you what. We wish you the best of luck with Unscheduled. We wish you the best of luck with, uh, with uh, the future season and the rest of your career. And thanks for joining us today, Mark. Thank you very much. Okay, back to the infield today.